Hi there, I'm Jane Harvey, and I want to jumpstart today talking about two things we seem to be a little confused about, sin and consequences. The difference between the world and God is that in the world, you can only be pardoned by proving you deserve to be pardoned. With God, He pardons those who don't deserve it. Can I get an amen to that? So here's the truth. In grace, God completely forgives all of the sin to those who confess and put their trust in Him. Where the confusion comes in is even though God completely forgives our sin, He doesn't remove all of the consequences from it. The truth is, if we never had consequences, we'd never learn. Galatians 6, 7, and 8, do not be deceived. God is not mocked, for you reap whatever you sow. Sin has consequences, some worse than others. We all know from our own past relationships that we can't enjoy a close bond with someone who has either wronged us or when we have wronged them. The guilt causes the estrangement. And so it is the same with God. Our sin causes us to be estranged from God. The only way to ever repair a relationship is to go before the person you've wronged and humbly repent and ask for forgiveness. And so it is the same with God. When we are forgiven, we can let go of the guilt and the bond of fellowship is restored. So let's say we sin. We go before God, broken, ashamed, and beg for forgiveness, and God forgives us, except our life is in total shambles all around us. We think to ourselves, I knew God didn't forgive me. He's punishing me. Wrong. Our sin is forgiven. But we have to remember when we sin, it usually doesn't just affect us. It's like that pebble you throw in the water. It has a ripple effect. And those ripples are consequences. So today, let's ask him to remind us when the consequences of sin remains with us, God also remains with us. He doesn't just abandon us. Proverbs 3.20, good things happen to those who learn from their experiences, and the Lord blesses those who trust in Him. Let's go out and be a blessing to someone today, and I'll see you next time.